From Chattanooga Police are investigating the city's most recent homicide. Dominic Wright was shot and killed early this morning on Faust Street. He was just 22 years old. News Channel 9's Drew Balea was at the scene this morning and has the story. After Calm now, but early this morning, people filled oh, Faust no. Street after a deadly yes. shooting happened here at this vacant home. <laughs> Devastation, grief, and anger filled Faust Street early this morning. People overcome with emotion poured into the street after a man was shot and killed on the porch of a vacant house. The first thing that's important is to control the scene, uh, to make certain that we don't lose any evidence or contaminate the scene. Neighbors say they heard one gunshot, followed by four other shots several seconds later. This recent homicide ties last year's total of 19. It's unacceptable. We spoke with Chattanooga's new police chief, Fred Fletcher, this morning at a community meet and greet, which he was attending in between visits to the crime scene. When somebody's son or father or brother gets killed, it's important to us. And people are not statistics. They're individuals that have value. Uh, I was scared. I was shaken. I was frightened. I was almost in tears. Yolanda Besley runs a daycare on Faust Street, just two houses down from where the shooting happened. She says her street has no place for this violence. I want them to know that they should take it elsewhere because it kills kids out here. They have nothing to do with what's going on. Besley says she feels safe and parents don't need to worry. They don't have no reason to be frightened about bringing their kids to the daycare. We are secure. But for police, strengthening that security means getting help from those closest to the violence. What we're tired of is people being hurt in our community, and we're tired of people losing sons and daughters and parents, and we're committed to working with the community to get information to help solve these. Police say they're still searching for a silver Cadillac that may have been the getaway car. If you have any information, please contact the police. In Chattanooga, Drew Balea, News Channel 9. And police say it is highly likely that this morning's shooting is gang-related.